Hello, everybody. So today is a sponsored Star Rail stream. I'm really excited because I'm jumping like headfirst into the newest story update. All right. I think I might keep my PNG tuber over here because I feel like it's I feel like it's better for a lot of the games I play. Um. But anyone here who hasn't played Star Rail before, I hate how I have my chat set up right now. And my launch is <laughs> We're starting off great. Um, give me a second, give me a second. Alright, alright, there we go, there we go, there we go. Um, so today we're going to head first straight into the, um, the story quest. With her power and sword. Fuck off, Sage. <laughs> Leave Blade alone. He's, he's great, okay? And it's, you know what's funny? Actually, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Um, I'll tell you later. I'll tell you later. Um, I forgot what I was going to say, Sage. <laughs> oh, if you've never played Star Rail before, you can use the QR code or, um, do command hsr and it will give you a link you can sign up my link you can support me basically really really cool things um what else uh i think that's all it's and it has you it has to be your first ever account and you can't use a V actually, now that I think about it, it um it's phone only and it's gotta be your first account. It's gotta be your first account. Um and you can't use a VP uh, VPN or an ad blocker either. So there there's a bit to it, but you can support me. HSR is a good game too, so yeah. <laughs> I'm great at this, can you tell? Um but let's head Actually, let me claim some stuff first. And also, they give you some codes. Or they give you a code to use. The Audacity. I know. The, oh, I got 10,000 credits. That's what happens when you have Huoquo. And my Huoquo... <laughs> it's the fact my Huoquo is not even... Her, her little chest piece is not even leveled all the way. And people are using the hell out of her. Or I, I'm assuming they're using her. Um, and <laughs> yeah, I think he. I think he might want to. Um, for anybody wondering what Sage is talking about, um, Jebby has been haunting me in my roles um, for the past. Where is it? Where's Where's he? He's like right here. Oh, there he is. There he is. He's about to get pissed at me because I didn't notice him. Um, he's E five. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god he's e5 <laughs> and i have his light cone but i don't use his light cone because i i like the um the the dot one better where is it versus light cone it's like level 30 if i remember where are you bro why oh i scrolled past it i'm a dumbass here it is here's his light cone i probably you know what i noticed that effect hit right now and it makes me want to like equip it to him and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, but yeah. Um, I also reached my um, 300 rolls on the standard banner. So I was able to get my free character, Branya, Which she has dance, dance, dance on her. Don't judge me, okay? Don't judge me. Um, she will have her, her light cone soon. I just have to wait for Tangerine banner to come up and she'll she'll be coming she'll get the she'll get the good food you know um but i need to wait i'm browsing that right now for my energy what is it called in this game i don't even know what it's called trailblaze power <laughs> technically seven ah true you're right well no technically eighth Technically eighth if you include the like the light cone. Yes, but it's it would be eighth because of the light cone. <laughs> Cause I have his sig his sig light cone as well. 
Um, okay. What is my brain is okay? So I'm on 165 fair blaze power. Good stuff. Good stuff. Um, my brain needs to work right now. It's not working. Okay, we need to go to to the dude. That's what we need to do. <laughs> Where I thought it would be over here, but it's not showing up anymore. God damn it! Oh, it's right there in front of my face. All right, we're not gonna talk about it. <laughs> All right. There we go. <laughs> my brain. Hey, Aaron, what's up? Oh god, E6 Jeffy or E1 Branya first. Well, obviously E6 Jeffy's gonna happen first. It's I feel like it's highly unlikely. And before Branya starts haunting my ass and she's like, Hi, I've come for your 50-50. By the way. Oh gosh, I'm scared. Oh wait, I need to turn this up. I really do. I was thinking before, but now I'm really thinking it. We need to be able to hear this music. Or turn the shit up. Oh, yes. Okay. I'm glad <laughs> most people are here for the chaos. But you're here for the, the story, the theory crafting from the gremlin. So I'm, I'm happy. That's God, I love ta uh, Tangerine. Most people are not new HSR players. True! HSR players... Like, most people have tried HSR and, because, it, it, or so with HSR, because HSR is great. Can't turn real, real quiet. On, um, through the game? Now, now, you'll get E6 Jebby first, and then you'll get E1 ja uh, Branya when you eventually pull for a limited five-star harmony. Oh, God. Oh, that's probably because, um... How's that? Demo me much in I Janai. Sindanova. I need to turn this up as well. There we go. Lobita. It's her famous singer. Oh, yeah, because it ended off with we were um, seeing her with the hole in her chest. Then um, Sparkle was walking up to uh, what you would call it Sunday and was like, impersonating his sister and shit and trying to um like aggravate him kind of a little bit just a little bit いちょいとくけどこの件と僕は無関係だ。僕は不運にも現場に居合わせてしまっただけ。それはファミリーが証明してくれる。信じられないなら <laughs> she was trying to hide from him. <laughs> You're so real for that. No, he sounds amazing in JP. What are you talking about, Sage? This, this is what we need to talk about. You and your bad, your terrible taste, Sage. You need to get better taste in things. Bro, what the fuck did you do to piss everyone off, Tangerine? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Game a little bad. I'm trying not to turn it up too high. Okay, I turned it up a little bit. I hope it isn't too loud now. <laughs> At least it's something we have in common, hey! <laughs> <laughs> um <laughs> but hey hey he is probably the most trustworthy of all the people in my opinion in this fucking um in this fucking plot or caught up in this plot except for obviously the astral express baby Nah, nah, Sparkle's the most honest? I don't, I don't know. Well, she might be the most honest, but she's also the most... Just because you're honest isn't... Like... Well, I guess I said trustworthy. 
but she's a bitch. I feel like Tangerine isn't a bitch. You know what I mean? He he isn't a bitch. She's a bitch about it. <laughs> Wait, why does it sound familiar? But I'm like, it's not coming to mind that TikTok audio. Tangerine is the only one we know is in Sparkle. Bro, I know that. Kanekoni has a, made a song. Yeah, safely turned reality. It's the fact I feel like So my theory behind this whole unbreakable defensive line is that they're able they're somehow manipulating everybody. Manipulating everybody's mind. It kind of seemed that way um when they were talking I don't remember when it was. I think it was in one of the events. And it was not... It was not something like... Uh, what should I say? It was not like... It was like a... You know how the events have like those throwaway like plots and lines and some... That like you shouldn't... They're not really super important. But sometimes they drop some really important like lore drops occasionally. Um... It seemed like they dropped something about how the the prison mates that were there before Penacone became the Penacone they know now um, is that they manipulated the way that the prisoners experienced like memoria or something. I don't know. I don't remember exactly. It's been such a bit that it's um, but that was that's my theory behind the whole everybody's happy here. We're able to protect everybody. Yes, Hami Prison Break. That's exactly that's exactly where it was, but I don't remember exactly what part of it was. To be fair, I've been uh well actually, never mind. Um Words are hard, okay? <laughs> We're so hard. <laughs> really hard. <laughs> okay. Create a death in the dreamscape. Not even a memo keeper could do that with that. Oh, there's about um, Black Swan. He could have done it. And that's that was okay. <laughs> to be fair, you're a bitch. I am absolutely a bitch. That's why I get along with a bunch of bitches, you know? I'm just like a magnet. Well actually no, that wouldn't make sense because with magnet magnets, I think it's like polar opposites that attract. Right? If I remember. Like the source didn't Yeah. Um, my bad. I'm not like a magnet. I'm like a a something. I'm a something. Um, so I know this was, I think Soup was the one that brought that up, that it seemed to be connected to, um, Acheron. I think I'm pronouncing that right. Um, actually, I'm going to purposely call her Archon the whole time, just to piss off Soup. <laughs> just to, just to, just to nudge her in the wrong way. <laughs> um... And she does have a similar, um, a similar color scheme as well. Archon is closer. Archeron? <laughs> 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 
次の犠牲者になるのは誰かな If her death was a foregone conclusion, Robin and her misfortune was staring right at her. Who will be the next to die? I'm gonna say that's just one side of the story. I want to learn more before I like I make any hard conclusions. I'm just gonna call her Ar 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 Archon. Like Karen? The very. A Karen? Oh. <laughs> Wait. Archon. Archon? 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 I thought. Archon? I'm okay. Oh god. <laughs> I am in pain. <laughs> I managed to stop myself. Alright, wherever the legacy wherever wherever the legacy is concerned, convert plans are already underway throughout Pentecone. Everyone's got their own agenda. Interesting, interesting. And you all laugh again. Oh god. I need to stop. Alright. Holy shit. Alright. Whew. We're just gonna call her Archon, so I don't. <laughs> it's gonna come out either Archon or Akon. Either way, because I, I think Akon's great. Alright, careful you don't get stuck on the wrong side. If I were you, I'd keep my distance from it. <laughs> from Archon. After all, any schemes out in the open are always going to be better than a monster in the shadows, right? Monster in the shadows. Okay. I see what he means by that. でも表に出ている計略の裏にさらに深い陰謀がないなんて誰が言い切れるのかしら。Acheron. What did I say before? Archeron? Archeron? Acher. Okay. Acheron. Okay, I got it. <laughs> yes, she really walked in like the. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Sue. So um <clears throat> what are, what are the memories again the memories on memes are they like are they like the um like the different existences that um exist in the dream worldscape like the like the billboards and shit like that by the <laughs> Bro. Frickin' Yarello. Um. Yeah. I still think, so, I, my thought on previously was that Sunday was, he kinda, in a way, normally in stories, I feel like Sunday 
would be typically the protagonist in the sense that, oh, he's just trying to keep his um, prison system, or not his prison system, I love how I, t <laughs> his, um, his, you know, amusement park, uh, hotel, fantasy-esque place, um, clean and beautiful and gorgeous and all these people are coming in with their different schemes and messing it all up. But I feel like in this case, Sunday is the antagonist strictly because um, the way the dreamscape is controlled and possibly hiding things that he doesn't want to show. If that makes sense. <clears throat> Thank you for the drops. I, I just have them turned on. I never know if a game has drops or not, but you're you're welcome. You know, I'm I'm just a giver. You know, I'm such an altruist. Turning on drops. I like save everybody. Sundays are bro. I want to kick your ass soon because it feels like you're subtly spoiling things for me, and I feel like I need to kick your ass for it. Or wait, fuck, I'm not supposed to- <laughs> It's not serious, Hoyo, don't murder me, please. Memo Keeper, I think it- He's just a little guy. <laughs> oh god. Memo Keeper, I think our deal- Our little deal is finished. Interesting. Interesting. <laughs> カンパニーはガーデンと違って記憶にできることはかなり限られてるからねそれについては君もよくわかっているはずだ。I really like the BA for BS. Um the JP one? The It sounds like sleep. Yeah, she does have a calming voice. I also like the um the English one. The English one has a very um interesting interpretation of her, in my opinion. I feel like she's a bit more expressive and it gives her a um it gives her a different edge to her than the ones where so in the JP one to me she comes off a bit like mysterious and very um distant from everybody. But she's very calming and relaxing. Um, my friend, oh, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> um, whereas the the English one, she has she seems a little bit more emotive, but she's very um, she seems very mature, um, and she knows what she's talking about, kind of thing. And but she's she's not as distant as the JP one, so it's very too dr drastic. That's my my interpretation of what I've, like, heard of her, like, VA from Soup's screen. Um, but they're, they seem very, it's slightly different. I find it interesting. Bro, oh, stop looking at my screen. I know, I'm such an asshole. <laughs> oh shit, I didn't realize that. So he so he wants he's helping the IPC assume uh, assumedly retake over Panacone. Um but it seems like he lost something in the beginning. What did he lose in the beginning, though? That's what I'm wondering. Because Ratio, I'm pretty sure, said he's useless without them. And pen the Pentecone people took them. Or, Sunday, namely. And his people took them, I think. Or it seemed like Sunday his people took it. I don't know. Also, really interesting thing to remember from the beginning. Sunday said he was he was like a true leader um, compared to other the other family members. So I also was theorizing that he might be able he might be trying to take control of all of Pentecone. No, Welt said that, but he also said that. Well, was pointing out that he said that specifically, and I do remember him saying that. 
it was in his um interaction with us sunday so well was just pointing out something that sunday said but sunday said it was talking to us we were there for that at the beginning when we were at the when we were first entering Pentacone and we run into a bed train and then Sunday comes in and we have a little conversation with him and Robin. <clears throat> Sunday is literally says that to us, I'm pretty sure. When we are present. So that would make sense then. Why is... So... They said the existence of death is connected to... Acheron. But... They've all, they also, he just said that they've hushed up the existence of death before. Has, but has Akron been here? I assume she hasn't been there before because then they would be more familiar with her existence and why she wouldn't be a good idea to have in the dreamscape, I'm assu assuming. Um, wait, the existence of death. Wait, they're talking about something else. Okay, so something unto death was the thing that's associated with Acheron. But death is something that's happened in the dreamscape before. So they can cover it up. Okay, I get that now. So that so is that maybe the manipulation? <laughs> Here it is, the wild theory crafting. So this is something unto death. Okay. Um, so this is probably the manipulation part. They're able, because people are in a dreamscape, things that occur in it. Interesting. Okay. So they're probably able to manipulate things and uh, make people forget things that happen in the dreamscape and stuff like that. I've got something on right now. Um, I'm gonna say what kind of help. Interesting. Okay. And the other thing that I find interesting... Sunday... He was... So I remember right after like the 2.0 update... Um, people were like making all kinds of fan art like about how... Um, Sunday um, cares a lot for his sister. Um, I don't remember if it was in connection to Ayako and Ayato or whatever, um, but there's a lot of that. But when you really think about like the interaction at the end with, well, I don't know. It's hard to say because Sparkle. He knew that Sparkle was in transforming into his sister, but he seemed kind of cold. Like, oh, you got to make sure your voice is um, ready for the performance. You can't make us look bad, kind of things like that. It was probably like an R. Yeah, I was thinking that. Um, it's like I think I thought there was a light cone or something, but I couldn't remember exactly if there was or not. Um, but he seemed kind of cold and distant. But I don't know if that was because of Sparkle. He was seemingly... And I don't know if he seemed to change his demeanor or something. I don't know. It's hard to say. Um, his, my memory is not the best. 
この悪い知らせはファミリーにとってとても不利なものだからきっと外部の人間特にカンパニーの介入を全力で阻止しようとしてくるだろう This tragic news would be extremely bad for the family, so they'll do anything they, everything, everything they can to, to stop it leaking, especially to the IPC. But it will probably be a lot of problems in the future. That's why it's necessary to you guys. The name of the Seikyo Resha is very clear, so the Seikyo Resha will be able to give you a good opinion of you guys. The Seikyo Resha will be able to give you a good opinion of you guys. The Seikyo Resha will be able to give you a What's gonna happen? Why? I'm wondering, why does the IPC so badly want this as a prison again? I'm thinking it has to be super powerful. Much more. Well, obviously, it's probably powerful because of the way it's able to make dreamscapes and stuff like that. But how did they lose. How did he lose it to the, the Harmony people, I wonder? Well, I think they explained it, actually. But I, I just can't quite remember. I want to take advantage of the family's trust in us. I'm, gonna, I'm tempted to go with this. Because... As much as I trust Tangerine, I do not trust the IPC. And an employee can't really... And he... he it's been obvious that he's been pointed out. He's, he's kind of a lowly, like... Not, like, highly seen employee. He... They literally... He's literally a slave to them. Um, from what they've hinted at. So obviously he can't maneuver or tell them what to do that much. He's just a pawn, really. Um, but family trust. Uh, you know what? <sighs> this is so hard to. You know, what? I'm just gonna say, just just a. Okay, thank God. We can talk to our companions. Yeah, Himiko is the best one to make this decision. She is familiar with them. She's handled the. You know, I'm thinking it. You know what I just thought of? So Tobaz was on a planet where the IPC. Save them, um, essentially from ruin. Um, Venturine, something obviously happened to his planet and his people. I wonder if IPC. I wonder if the IPC purposely hires people who have like a debt to them or that don't have equal grounds to them to kind of hold something over their heads. And you know what's even more gross if that's the case? That they have them constantly competing for high rates and stuff like that um, over the work they do, which would make... <laughs> Gosh, the IPC would be a beast if that's the case. Employing people who... Oh gosh, that... Yeah. Aventurine,言うだけ言って言っちゃった。確かに無理強いする気はないみたいだけど、なんか引っかかる。yeah, I do. So as much as I trust Tangerine, the way he's been so sh that whole conversation, and that's different from a normal sales organization. No, that's it's not. But it, it's so at a baseline, it's probably not that different from a normal sales organization. But it's taken to such a high degree, if you know what I mean. Like it's almost like a um, he was making a commentary off of that. 
if you know what I mean. Because the Hoyo tends to, like, um, people don't even realize it a lot of the time, but Hoyo tends to take a lot of, like, real life issues and make a commentary on it very smoothly through their um way of using um their plot devices in um like their stories in their fictional worlds i find it absolutely amazing like um like for example a big one is um i always think of um sumeru and genshin impact how the akasha has such a powerful um like uh powerful like a power over people's um or the scholars these intelligent people yes you remember the hasha um and how the these scholars who are extremely intelligent are overly reliant on this system that has access to everything to the point that they um, don't even doubt it and some of them even abuse it because of the reputable um, the reputation the Akasha has and um, you can even talk about it also being a commentary on how much faith they have in this one person um, what is it the they have what, what is it uh, Rukadvata they had so much faith in the system because Rukadvata made it and like great and almighty archon that's passed that they didn't even want to respect the lesser lord Kusanali who came right after her and stuff like that um so I think I think yeah anyway I was gonna talk about how eventually as much as I trust him he seems a little bit too straightforward here um which it feels like he's there's something else he's like failing not i don't know if he's failing to mention it or he's purposely not telling the whole truth and i feel like it has to do with the ipc he's not saying much of what the ipc is going to do he just says what they want and that it was theirs in the first place i'm gonna give you a timer for a screen because <laughs> i talk so much i'm a talker <laughs> All right, I got through that. Are you proud of me, Aaron? I got through that. Um. Okay. I just want to look at that. The theory crafter I can't stop crafting theories and talking about my previous ones. Has anyone made the meme with the guy with the red stripes on the forefoot? Evie? Wait, didn't Soup do that? I think Soup made- I think- I think Soup made a meme with me with one- not necessarily maybe the red one or the one with the red strings, but the um- I thought there was some kind of meme with me and like lore board. The <laughs> lore board. Oh gosh. Can you give me a favor if you um send it on the servers? Send it also in um the the gremlin server, the gremlin's den. Yeah, I think there's something with the IPC. We're not. He's not quite telling us yet. So he's also kind of manipulating us, playing on us, playing on our emotions right now. This is the truly chaotic thing. But you know what? I'm gonna go with the nameless cannot turn a, a blind eye to evil. I also understand where she's coming through with that. So, 
Because good people can have also also have their own motives, if that makes sense. And because of their motives, it can make them even seem good or like bad. Sometimes bad people do or no. Some people sometimes good people do bad things for good reasons. If that makes sense. Or no. Yeah. Or people generally can do good things. Or no. Bad things for good reasons. Which can kind of sometimes make it seem good. Depending on the context, the situation, and all that. So she's actually got an insight to Acheron. But didn't you have a little, like, tango with her? Have you started the timer? <laughs> no, you're not joking, Soup. How dare you, uh, not be- How dare you be so- so serious, Soup. You're not allowed to be very serious. She's the most special. She's like an unpredictable beast, essentially, is how they're painting her. She could lash out at any time, and her motives are completely... Well, yeah, that's... Yeah. あの大きな傷口はあの翼の刃によく似てるあいつの強行の瞬間は見たことがあるでしょ We have a chance to make a choice, make one that you know and took it personally. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, because I heard it can change your, um, so it might not change how the plot necessarily is, but it can change your relationship with the, um, with different people, if that makes sense. That's how it was in 2.0 with Secret Anger. That's why I'm being very careful because I don't want to. I don't want to end up in a like with a. Like I don't want to sour a relationship with one of these people, um, if it wasn't my intention. If that makes sense. <laughs> Everything has been planned out and executed by someone. Hinakoni. It, it almost makes me want to say pina colada. It's pina colada. Oh. Or getting caught in the rain? What? In oh, interesting. Okay, so I think what they mean, um,. So if the, the person was going to choose the victims deliberately, um, it kind of is exposing the flaws of the family. They let a smuggler in, and the smuggler is doing whatever they want, and they died. Um, then a family celebrity, someone who's supposed to be the token of their reputa reputation, and uh, they're supposed to be protecting these people, and one of them actually di um, died, then that kind of puts cracks in their reputation and in their sort of um, beautiful, like, fantasy dream world. 
I don't have any other questions. Okay. Sorry, I read that really fast. So I was like, um, I want to see. I want to talk to my companions. Okay. Oh, this is where the pink, the pink birdies show up, or uh, not show up. Um, group up. So I'm theory faster. <laughs> I'm just zooming all over the place. My bad. There, there's, <laughs> there's Swan, um, daintily walking slowly towards. Oh, there's Sam, and then there's me. It's not even that fast anymore. God damn it! I posted the meme. Oh gosh, I want to see it. <laughs> I can't wait. My curiosity is. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yes! <laughs> I know, it's- it's beautiful. <laughs> oh gosh. What can I say? I'm- I'm quite the conspiracy theorist. When it comes to stories. Should I put on my tinfoil hat? Oh my god. <laughs> I should make that a vote. I need to make- I need to have something- No. I already thought of like a chalk- like a- Like the- Similar to like the chalkboard kind of thing. A vote. Maybe I should- I was- Well, maybe I should also have like a tinfoil a hat a moat thing. <laughs> To say this is where we find eyes. Oh, that's what I thought. Like, you know what's interesting about this? The translation, we all walk through this world casting shadows of different lengths. And Eidolons are literally, literally shadows. So just, just a thought. Just a, just, 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 just a thought. And you know what? You know what also interests me in this case? Um, the way she talks about it and ultimately all we leave are precious memories. <laughs> I am absolutely certified. Um, ley lines. Ley lines, the way they work in Genshin. Of course, they just a little bit of ley line trouble can cause just some disturbance with like your health and stuff like that. But... Sometimes, if you remember in Raiden's Quest, a huge ley line disturbance can cause um, actual um, like memories of different people to show up in the world, even though they've long passed. Oh, I have to get right on back on the screen. これは私からの I'm hiding something from you? I guess it's because for her hiding about like her deal with a veteran and stuff like that. Let's say thank you. <laughs> you want ASMR? There's quite a few of um. JPVAs who get involved in 
doing um different like drama CDs and stuff like that. So I couldn't I I could see her having like a ASMR like CD or something like that. There's some of them that do ASMR too. I should have mentioned that first. You just gotta find her um voice acting or her voice actor and you can search up the material she's done. As <laughs> Ooh. What is she doing? I'm curious. What fascinating memories will bring next time? Interesting. Leviathan, you still at the hotel in Dreamscape? Leviathan, Leviathan, if you weren't to trouble. Jesus Christ, they're probably worried sick for us. We got separated in the memory zone, but Leviathan is with the memo keeper. I feel so antsy. Help, March, stay, stay calm. Do I need to get off the express and help? Oh my gosh, Don Hang is like that mom friend. That like, he's like, do I really need to get off and sort your shit? Not the moment. Shorge, let me know if you need me. The reverie hotel in the real world is very calm. Not much is happening. Um, where are you? I will turn this aspect <laughs> express around right now. <laughs> He's really... <laughs> That's done, Hang. Eviathan, Eviathan, <laughs> Jesus Christ. I, I, you know what, I'm just gonna skip over my name. I hate saying my name so many times. Um, it's great that you're safe. That lady didn't do anything bad, did she? I'm sorry about what happened to Firefly. The scene, the scene has been cordoned, 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 cordoned off by the family. We're wrapping up negoti negotiations with some family delegates. Let's meet somewhere near the hockey statue later. Yes, ma'am. There's a class right there. I haven't done any. Oh. <laughs> I love running into these things and getting run over. Come on, run me up, you bitch. Thank you. God damn it. Get fucked, bro. I'll send you all into accidents. Sorry, I my free money. Hey, buddy. Did I scare you? I scared a billboard. They show me here. Okay, they're probably gonna all show up when I get there. Something's gonna happen, isn't it? I feel it. There's something's gonna happen. Oh, we're getting sent somewhere else. Oh, so this is the past. Oh shit! What the fuck is going on? This thing by your hand. Oh shit! Days ago, Everflame ma Mansion. Oh shit! So she's in her normal form right now. ためらうよちなどんな。トフェトのエンマ。たとえあなたが命を捧げたとしても、あのアイオンの恩寵は受けられない。レンジャー。お前が歩んでいるのは今日は命。The hunt. So canonically she's the hunt. Wait, I'm very confused right now. 
私たちは炎の中から誕生した炎を浴びて生まれ広がる焼き破壊する薪が燃え尽き全てが死の灰になるまで We spread, burn, and destroy until all the kindling has burned out, and we leave only ashes on the ground. What if I another universal truth? That's an interesting way of looking at things. That's such a cool character design, though. There's no way he dies, right? You know, it'd be an interesting plot if the kids, if, he, if Akron kills him, and then the kids want to revive him, kind of thing going on. So he's already dying. So if I interpret it, if I'm to. If I think, if I bubble ball words, um, if I'm interpret interpreting this correctly, he was already dying before Acheron was there. I think, I think that's what he was saying. Unless he's saying uh, Acheron. Has him dying, but he he wants before he dies, he wants to destroy Penacony. Because on the path they have forged, you have traveled farther than I have. Is he talking about the Aeons? Because on the path that the Aeons have created, she has tread farther. So she, so he wants to surpass her. So he can get noticed by the Aeons? Am I reading that? Or they were fighting and she gives him a moment to say some words. To be fair, I feel like this is more reasonable than um, a lot of... Um, like anime fight scenes where they stop and start talking she is trying to she's not she, she's made it clear that she does not want to kill him um she's made it clear that she does not want to kill him at this moment um she just wants the music blocks um if you were reading that correctly <laughs> um but I, I think this is more reasonable than other fight scenes where they just pause and stop and they, she just wants the music box. She does not want to kill him. Um, and she she's wondering why he won't just give up this music box for his life that not only he cares about, but his children care about as well and are fighting for him to survive. He is clearly not bent on just making that easy and stuff. But I think he wants to surpass her, um, surpass her so he can maybe possibly get noticed by the aliens? Is it, I think, what I'm interpreting from this? Hide your true identity, draw the sword for we shall re indeed remain here. Bound to fight a decisive battle to the death, for I choose this.
Structuring is tense but brief. To cravenly cling to life is to endure an endlessly prolonged existence. Are you sure you aren't um following the path of nihility, my dude? あなた自身を破滅させるものであったとして。答えは重要ではない。重要なのは、お前の存在と同じく、それが存在しているということだ。すべては滅ぼされるために存在している。司令とてレベルを。Give me a second. I'm back. So is she in collusion with him? I always, I always find that really cool. Um, fight style is fighting with the um, the scabbard of a of a sword. I think that's what it's called. The hilt, or not the hilt. The hilt is the thing you hold it with. The um, the thing that holds the sword, essentially. About to say, isn't she nihility? I think, yeah, pretty much so. Interesting. So she killed him. Okay. ご苗な偽装はたくさん見てきたが、外見は隠せても心は隠せないものだ。あなたも例外ではない。あの開拓者、あなたは彼女を殺そうとしなかった。あなたが手を出したのはあくまで私とあのメモキーパーを追い払う
So she's aware of the script. So she's aware of the script. So my brain had a theory, but I forgot it. It drifted away. Oh, I remember it. Yeah. Did you have a theory? I remember. I um. I'll wait till the reveal, though. <笑>そこまで興味を持たれる。いや、いや、いや、I don't have my brain doesn't have a theory. My my cell has a, a theory. <laughs>私はよく忘れてしまうから記憶よりも感覚でものごとを捉えるようにしているんだ。私にはその冷たい甲冑の中にいるのが誰かわかる。あ、シェ。鎧を脱いで話す気になったか。but what are, what is the truth? I'm wondering. Oh, okay. So what I know is that I know that I know that I so I guess the Stellaron Hunters, even if the Astral Express is like, I don't like you, the the Stellaron Hunters uh, trust them. You know what's funny? <laughs> In a way, that um, I have a feeling, or I wouldn't doubt that the Stellaron Hunters probably trust the Nameless more than the IPC. Which is just even more funnier with the the revelation we had earlier. その必要はありません。あなたには教えても構わないでしょう。ヘリオが私に与えた指示は一つだけ。それは請求列車に共に大いなる遺産を負わせること。もっと簡単で直接的な手を使い、この件を終わらせようとしたのですが、結果はご覧の通りです。私は今ここであなたと対峙している。つまり失敗しました。脚本には逆らえないということですね。Ilio, I'm assuming, wanted Sam to kill her? So... The only thing... See... This is the thing I'm wondering now. What is Ilio's script's end goal? I always assumed it was something good. And I, I'm, 
I'm assuming... <sighs> but I don't... Hmm. You can see how she... Confronting? Isn't the same as killing? But he says, I tried telling this in an easier and more direct way, but as you can see, here I am confronting you. I failed. I can't ever go against the script. So maybe he doesn't... Maybe, maybe you're... Okay, I think... I think he's saying that he's not supposed to confront her, at least. You might be right in the sense that, like, he's not supposed to necessarily kill her, but he's at least not supposed to confront her either. So was he supposed to, so was he not supposed to fight her at all or what? Let me, let me just move on and see. Oh, okay. That makes sense. わかれる前にもう一つ聞いてもいいか。あなたの脚本の中に私に関係することは書かれているか。運命が見た未来の中で私がどういう脚注を残したのか知りたいんだ。残念ですが、一言も触れられていません。Interesting. So is either is she a unknown variable or is she gonna die? Those are the two things that I'm wondering. She, he doesn't, or they don't understand why she's not in the script, I'm guessing? Eh, eh, eh. <laughs> oh my gosh. あなたの最初の質問です。まだ夢を見るか、自分のせいで死んだものの夢を。答えはノー。一度も見たことがありません。私には生まれつき夢を見るという機能が備わっていません私は冷たい現実のために生き本のかすかな光のために燃え灰になるまで燃え続けるのですこの was born without the ability to dream it lived for this cold harsh reality for a little light and to burn and to keep burning until I turn to ash. And now he's in front of Cody. Oh, I get you, I get you. In a dream. Yeah, I was thinking that. And what's even more interesting is that they're both fire and destruction. It does seem like they were trying to um, parallel or have a, like a, what's it called? A foil to each other, kind of? But I wonder in which way that the purpose of Sam foiling to Duke Inferno is... Um. Uh. Let me double check. I'm pretty sure. Wait, am I remembering that wrong? Foil literary device.
Okay, maybe I'm thinking of the wrong thing then. In any narrative, a foil is a character who contrasts with another character, typically a character who contrasts with the protagonist, in order to better highlight or differentiate certain qualities of the protagonist. Foil to the protagonist may also be the antagonist of the plot. You, that's what my impression is, and I think... Well... I guess a winner is kind of is the same thing as opposites attract, in a way. Because it's like, they reflect each other. Um... I guess in a way, Sam could be... I don't know. So, the reason why I was thinking of liking them, of liking them to foils is the fact that, obviously, they're f both fire and destruction. Um, but, well, well, obviously, it would not be the reason, because it's supposed to be opposites. Mirrors reflect? Yes, they reflect, but they're... It's... They're still... Well... They still keep the same, like, form, if that makes sense. But anyway, anyway. Um, what I was getting at is they're similar in the sense that they're both fire and destruction. Um, but I don't know. They seem to have, like, a connection where they, they have a point where they are similar, but they detract from another. Yeah. Um, but do you get what I'm saying? Like, so they're similar that they're fire and destruction and they're obviously both had this confrontation. Yeah, they even both had the confrontation with Akron. But I'm trying to figure out what necessarily is the traits that they're that the maybe it's the that the, the traits that they're supposed to display in each other, or they're obviously supposed. To, I don't know if that makes sense. They're both fire and destruction. They both had a confrontation with Agron. But what traits are they trying to... They're supposed to make each other stand out from each other. I feel like I'm wording that really wrong. But... It wasn't quite clear to me um, what exactly is the difference between the two of them. Or if they're just more similar. And that line, too. Damn. Oh. Yeah, you're right. Thank you, Sue. So she spared. She spared Sam. Wait. Okay. Also, number two thing. Didn't she say something about dreams? To him and they there was a, a, a focus on dreams with um with ifrit there was extreme like he he's kind of <laughs> he's he's the lulu <laughs> ifrit is the lulu um <laughs> confirmed a certified and delivered but sam is more he literally cannot be the lulu He, he's not Delulu. Well, there's the do you dream, but he doesn't. He says, no, I don't. Because I do not dream. All I have to deal with is the cold, hard reality. Is literally what he says. Whereas Duke Inferno, he dreams about um, burning and destroying Panacone. He must surpass um, Acheron. Because he wants to get noticed by the Aeons and stuff like that. <laughs> he was snorting some soul death. Soul death. Yes, yes, exactly. So, the difference between 
Okay, that's that's what we figured out. So, and and you can see. And okay, another thing, another thing, another thing. Um, another thing. Okay, let me explain this. All right. So, Ifrit and Sam are foils. They're both fire and destruction. Um, they're both fire and destruction. They both have that line that's extremely similar. However, Ifrit dreams about a lot of things, but he dies. And he... The one thing he holds on to, though, is that things that are impossible to achieve just haven't happened yet. Whereas, Sam... Wait, 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 wait. Shh, shh. Let me finish this thought. Sam... Sam faces the whole reality of things, but is be in belief that the, s the script cannot be changed. Cannot ever be changed. That is the huge difference. Okay, now it makes sense now. It makes complete sense. Dreamy dude, but dude believes impossible. Things can change. Just, it hasn't happened yet. Dude holds to reality and believes that, yep, There's a lot of even know one. <laughs> but you get what I'm saying? You get what I'm saying? You get what I'm saying here? One dreams possible yet yet to happen. The other sees reality but believes that everything will stay <laughs> to oh, it's actually a space where I've been clicking. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Someone put her on autoplay. <laughs> <laughs> you asked for this, Aaron. You got it. If I put it on autoplay, I would have missed too much. I am here for this, the <laughs> I don't think she asked for this. <laughs> Calculating. I'm glad. I'm glad. まずは状況を整理しましょう。あんたの言葉を聞いて思い出したことがあるの。みつきちゃん、私たちが交渉したファミリーの代表が何て言ってたか覚えてる？え、interesting. Oh, so they're talking about their confrontation with the family. Wait, earlier? Was it another murder? Other than Robin? Oh shit, okay, okay. So, so... So, tra I'm guessing Trailblazer are told them everything. But the murder that followed closely after was beyond their anticipation. The family had to try and turn things to their advantage while by bringing in reinforcements from the outside. The Charmony. I'm sorry, I did not like that name. The Charmony. The Charmony Festival is nearly here. They must be so tender. It may also be that Miss Firefly's murder had so many witnesses that it couldn't be covered up. Yeah, that does make sense. Family が何より警戒しているのは良からぬことを考える訪問者でしょうね。例えばあのカンパニーの死者とか。
I'm gonna say this. Because I don't know if he's completely up to no good, or is it just the IPC up to no good? I don't know. I don't know what to say about Aventurine at this moment. I mean, so with with Aperon, I feel like Aventurine um I feel like Aventurine, it makes the most sense that Aventurine is cautious against her with the clues and context he is given, but I think he might be a bit off. That makes sense from his judgment from her. とにかくまずは情報を集めてできるだけ多くの可能性を並べてみようそれから矛盾を一つずつ取り除き残った事実が少なくなるほどそれが真実である可能性が高くなるただこれだけ多くのことが起こっても俺たちは it's like we're stuck in a whirlpool spinning around that legacy even after everything that's happened. I'm going to go ahead and make that decision.列車の乗員の人格を信用していなければ、外部の人間にスキャンダルと呼べるような事件の調査を依頼したりしないもの。それに、ここはファミリーのテリトリー。彼らと手を組むことは、今後の行動においても役に立つはずよ。アベンチュ
Let's say just we'll be an asshole and say that's it. <laughs> Oops, I pressed to or send too early. Here's a little extra just for good luck on the ring. Bro, this asshole just gave me another hundred thousand. Just as I anticipated, the family is going to sweep Robin's case under the rug for as long as they can. So your case is only a secret between us. But the other case, that depends on what excuses they have prepared for you guys. I'll take my leave for now. I look forward to outstanding performance from you guys. Wait, fuck. I didn't- wait, his tagline. I just realized what you meant by that. Wait, where's the phone thingy? Oh, there it is. What? Oh, this is from me. Okay. Uh, if I said, do you have time? I want to ask you a question. Which do you like the most? Four responses I see. This must be because I got her. Can I? I okay, I guess I can't look at his thing again. Okay, you know what? I'll answer those shits later. ピノコニーを取り戻すこと。そのためには何としてもファミリーを倒して大きな心びを作る必要があるの。うん。死の存在はファミリーに隠されているけど。also, another thing to think about is the, um, the whole metaphor with death. Okay, give me, let me get through this and then I'll, um, or get the, the Himika's line and then we can check it out. The existence of death will be covered up by us. So how- wait. The existence of death will be covered up by the family, so how does he plan on taking down? It's got to be something important enough that everyone will notice, but it also can't be anything too out in the open. Yeah, I don't think there's no conclusions that can be drawn yet. Oh, I, don't, I didn't mean to come off as doubtful of you, Himiko. I just don't know exactly what his plan would be. <laughs> Alright. Where the fuck is it? So it can't. Okay. I'm. How do I get to the phone thingy? Do I have to go through Branya's shit? Wait, can I click on this? Yes, okay, there we go. What does it say? Oh, he's opened a pool for your game account. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Does he have better luck? I hope he does. Wait, obviously. I'm dumb as shit. I'm obviously it's better fucking pools than me. Jesus Christ. I wonder if Jeppy would stalk him too. Alright, let's talk to March. That's some interesting foreshadowing right there. <laughs> yeah, I love how we both were like. <laughs> She's just oogling, you know? <laughs> She was just shocked, you know? <laughs> Supposed to be inside a dream. How can someone die in a beautiful dream state like this? Shouldn't only good things happen here?
Do you think the family is behind us? You know what I just realized? If they're able to create dreams for everybody and they have access to people dream people's dreams, could it be a super powerful way of getting intel from different um all places all over the world, honestly? Yeah. Because they um collect memories and shit. Everyone's still having a great time out there on the streets. Nobody knows what's happened. It's also a real. As Firefly, Miss Robin, and us, we're all outsiders from another world. それじゃあ町の人たちと同じになっちゃう。アベンチリンさんの言葉の中でもう一つ気になっていることがある。彼は何も証拠がない状態で、あの巡回レンジャーがロビンさんを殺した容疑者だと告発した。だが彼女と。True, he did make the connection to um the something unto death. ここまで明らかに根拠のない推論は君の信頼を得る役に立たないどころか、かえって怪しまれるだけだ。why though? Does adventuring have other plans? I wonder. I wonder if the purpose of adventuring is to get to the end of your life. Or to get to the end of your life. Maybe. If you get to the end of your life, you will get to the end of your life. ただ、来ると言っていたはずのアナイアレイトギャングが消息を絶ったことについては、列車に残っている炭鉱にも確認した。これはアベンチュリンさんの作り話ではないようだ。She She's a very mysterious woman, I would say. What? What? Interesting。あの連中は不思議で捉えどころがない上に一匹狼でいたがる。疑われるのも無理はないな。No, that's not why we don't remember. No, I'm not going with that world. I don't think see part of me so the first thing I wanted to go through was maybe it was part of the um the nihility effect that Akron suffers from or seems to suffer from but at the same time it makes me black swan she's a memory collector so I'm like I'm wondering if it 
has some play by her or could it be the family because the family manipulates the dream space but they're in a dream right now right or are they not they're on the dream space it's from where we first landed on Hanukkah. Oh, I see what you mean. Okay, that makes sense. So it is Agar. Okay. Looks like adventuring it doesn't need anything else. Let's turn our attention to the family assignment for now. Because everything else is meaning. Okay, that makes sense. Because. Yeah, okay. I think I can make sense out of it. Um, let's turn our attention to the family's assignment for now. Let me go, what do you think? <laughs><笑><笑> そこWait a second. Look at the hotel. Perhaps we could also make a few inquiries about her out there. Oh, so she has to go to the hotel to check on the other people. Okay, so she's going to the hotel. Well, just splitting off from them? Do you, you're making me nervous, bro. <笑>あ、何かあったらすぐ連絡してくれ。is he about to confront someone? Okakujin. Detective Renaga. Akron! Rakaron? Akaron, right? Akaron. Akron? Akaron. Akaron. Skur. Akaron. Korewa Sure. Orewa Bertoyo. Say Kuresha no Ichinda. Oh, this bitch! Oh, this bitch was right when we were about to remember our impression. She raced it, that fucking bitch. Wait, they're meeting! I just realized they're meeting. その前に私の名前を聞かないのか。その必要はないだろう、ヨミさん。君は今やピノコニーの有名人だ。彼らは何と言っている アナイア・レイト・ギャング。栄華たとえ悪党であっても、そんな言い方をされるべきじゃない。What? Is she speaking highly of him? Mashteo, 
正体に応じてやってきた不審者は大勢いる彼らは本当に一振りの超党があなたのブラックホールよりも危険だと思っているのか Oh shit! <laughs> She got well the fuck out! Kimi wa kanga surdo yo na na. Family desu ra, kono tsue no honto no sugata wa minuke na gatta da ga. Oh wait, they're both nihility! I just realized they're both、uh, on the path of nihility. In a way. Sore nara Kimi mo rikai shite yo haz da, Yomi san. Black hole o nozoku koto wa kenme de wa nai to. 潜在的な危険分子として君は俺たちのことを不快なまでに知っている正体を明かしてここに来た目的を教えてくれる重力に引き裂かれる覚悟をした方がいいフランパーズレディーファイトヒーストロンヘンズヒーライフアンバウトパンチューアンクルスロウそんなことは起こらないがそれで七死人たちに警戒を解いてもらえるなら喜んで協力しようあなたが信じようが信じまいが巡回レンジャーヨミそれが今の私の肩書きだそしてピノコニーを訪れたのはある遠い医師の医師の An old final request. So it's so is it not for the Duke and Farmer? I'm guessing it's for somebody else farther than that. But she was Tokea no Isan no Tamenikita. So did I get a Korea Juven Shojikini Hanashi to Hello. Oh shit. Oh, oh shit. Oh my god. Wait. Fuck is raiding me. Oh my god. I'm gonna. Okay. Oh shit! Oh my god! Okay, I'm low key fangirling. <laughs> Bob is f- I'm so honored to be raided by Baku. Holy shit. Oh shit. Thank you for the follow. Thank you for the raid. Holy shit. Please check out、um, Yankee Bancho or Baku.、Um, they are really chill ass. Um, chaotic streamer. If you, <laughs> I usually, if she's streaming at the end of the night, I send my、uh, chat towards her to calm them down a little bit, you know, give them a vibe for the end of the day. Gosh.、Um, we're playing h o l k a i s t a r o right now. Not typically something I play.、Um, well, I usually play it off stream, not on stream, but we're, they came out with a really interesting story quest. So we're going through that, analyzing the hell out of it. Um, and yeah, <laughs> it's a vibe right now. <laughs> oh gosh, I'm <laughs> I'm so happy. Hi, <laughs> my heart. Oh, 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 I need to catch up on Honkai Star Rail. It's getting so good right now.、Um, I, I just started the new story quest. Gosh. <laughs>、um, yeah. And it's sponsored. So it's lit. <laughs> also, I,、uh, I am at the new story, so I hope I, I, hope I don't spoil anybody. I've seen the new characters. I want to meet them. Oh, yeah. I love, I love adventuring.、Um, Akron is very mysterious. I don't know what to think of her.、Um, and Black Swan, she's very, she's very nice, but I don't trust her quite yet. I don't, I don't trust her yet. Not completely, at least. But I, I won't be offended if you, if you, wanna,、uh, if you don't want to get spoiled or anything. But if you do want to catch up, I am more than welcome to try to catch you up on the deets on what's going on right now. Or if you have any questions that will help you understand like, what's going on right now. 
Um, I will definitely tell you. But, um, yeah, I'm, I can't wait till um, Aventurine's banner because I am most definitely going to roll for him. Okay, everyone has their own unspeakable past, secrets that they don't want revealed, and I won't be asking any more questions, such as why the... With a stellar on Dan, they really calling us out right now. Oh shit, but at the same time, Akron's very protective of us at the same time. Also to give the like a vague catch up right now, um, we're right now in the middle of a huge plot in this dreamscape, um, and we do not know exactly who to trust, and we're trying to figure out what exactly is going on and why are certain things being hidden and what exactly everybody is up to. All while searching for this um, sort of legacy that is seems to stem kind of possibly from the Astral Express, which is where we, the crew that we're with. さまざまな無境を訪れ、数々の調査を行った。その過程で多くの客とつながりを持ち、気づいたことがある。それはピノコニーの秘密は、かつての開拓と深い関わりがあるのかもしれないということだ。あなたたちに助けを求めに来た。まだ確たる証拠はないか。一つの可能性なら提示できる。すべての悲劇の元凶はファミリーの内部に潜んでいる。あなたが私を信じてくれるなら、一緒に証拠となる事実を探そう。So another um, background with this is that the last update with this, the first part of the story, we kind of had this horror movie kind of thing going on in the very like underbody of this whole dreamscape. And it seems like something bad happened, but we don't exactly know what happened. ここまでにしよう。とりあえず君に敵意がないことは信じる。Also, wait. I don't know if you guys saw, but well, was about to fuck her up. <laughs> he was about to fuck her up. Not knowing, I don't know if he would have won, but he was about to fuck her up. <laughs> it was great. I mean, a suicide with Tanin no Handa or Midashtakanaika. What are these names for these drinks? So I'm a little bit worried with the Welt on his own. The conversation? Wait, is she going to do something to Welt? Is she going to do something? Is she about to do something to Welt? Oh my gosh. If... So, what is the name of this animatic? Um, let me search it up real quick. Fuck. Is this, so, what she's referencing right now is a Honkai Star Rail animatic that we saw. I think it was called Rondo or something? Rondo across countless kalpas. With, this is what she's referencing right now as an animatic that they posted on YouTube um, called Rondo across different kalpas. It's a really insanely interesting, um, extremely well animated 
and has so much symbolism littered without it with um ab around it in it all over the place um, I even showed it to a friend who doesn't watch or, like, isn't really involved in Hawkeye Star Rail, and he was able to, like, break down the different symbolisms, like, that show in that animatic, which was so, in like, it kind of shows you how amazing and, like, how much of a masterpiece that animatic was. <laughs> わたしはこの飲み物はカラクテ苦く美しい夢の味じゃないスラータに飽きた人にしか向いてないと言ったのそうか私には両者に違いはないように思えるわ <laughs> definitely, Aaron, definitely. Oh my. Are latent memories that linger on it. Anata ni cancer kyoku. Anata dake no mono janai. Watashina stayed koto a oak. Toy mirai no koto mo yogen de kiru. Toto sta teo tskaiba. Shani kuchio hiraka seru koto da te de kiru no. Thanks. Yeah, I know it was going around Twitter quite a bit, and people were like, oogling all over it for all the good reasons, or all the right reasons and all the good reasons, you know? It's insanely good animatic. And even, um, another thing, if you want to check it out, is, um, Acheron's, um, what is it, character trailer or teaser or something like that? is has much more thought into it than the normal ones it seems at least in my opinion and the way they go about it yeah they're there are animations on there. I love how I'm calling it an animatic when it's an animation. Um, I'm pretty sure. But their animations are amazing for Star Wheel. They're like straight up an anime. I'm pretty sure I think they have their own like Hoyo anime like um like brand or company or something. I'm pretty sure. Oh god. Black Swan. <laughs> Girly, we already went through this. Wait, what? Graduation 12. So she's supposed to be revealing what happened to, like, Ifrit. Even though we kind of seen a little bit of it earlier. Um, we saw the like encounter between um Agron and Ifrit. They're mentoring dreamscape now. Oh. That makes sense. So it was like a report. Wherever they go, she'll be met by annihilation. <laughs> I also find it insanely interesting that her eyes are colored like like dawn. Like there's a lot of um symbolisms with going on with like rebirth and shit like that going on in Pentacony right now. Yeah. 
すぐに途切れてしまった<笑> Yeah! So Another interesting thing、um, there was. So there's a.、Um, when we're. There's a previous interaction we have with a character,、um, and there's a bunch of meteors that they like pan out to.、Um, Genshin Impact's like rolling animation is also meteors, and we are later in a quest told that meteors are、um, a represent, representation of、um, fates. Meteor showers are a represent, representation of fates colliding, which is another thing to think about. And with Acheron's little animatic with the Rondo across different Kalpas, there's different people like falling from the sky at the very end of that, which could be seen as a meteor shower in a way. Another thing, I, I love all the underlying、um, like、symbolisms that Star Alex loves to give us. And Hoyoverse in general loves to give us. The land of sleep, merely wishing for undisturbed rest away from the storms. There's also, if you guys are interested, another animatic on his kids that are showing up here, like Dubra and all of them. Oh, shit. Yes! It, it, Panacony is definitely that. Without a doubt. Actually, um, so Sparkle's character trailer,、um, a lot of people thought it was, um, this, like, the imagery in it was very similar to Madoka Magica, but it was apparently, um, Like drawing inspiration from a、um, a、uh, like controversial like music video or music artist. Not controversial in the sense like、um, like in a, the traditional Western way, but in like、um, like apparently had references to like drugs or something like that or something. I don't know. I, I only got the, the vague gist of it and stuff like that.、Um, But it. Yeah. I think the. Oh, yeah, specifically the one I'm talking about is. There's a, a character called Sparkle. Sparkles? There's a character called Sparkle. And her. Actually, I specifically remember her Japanese name being、um, Hanabi. I believe it's like fireworks and stuff like that. I prefer her,、um, her JP translation of her name over, the, over Sparkle, but her name is Sparkle.、Um, actually, now that I think about it, the character teaser I'm talking about is called Monodrama, if you want to search it up. <laughs> I know I'm like handing out a bunch of videos to like look at, but they're like insanely good videos to watch.、Um, that's all. And it, I love the, strong, the song for、um, Monodrama. It's, the visuals are cool, the whole like plot, like, Things that are going on in the,、um, the video are insanely interesting, and then just, it's good. <laughs> you get a video, you get a video, yeah. <laughs> and actually, I really wanted to roll for her too, but I, I, had, I wanted to wait till. Because、um, I need to get Jinglu this patch. I need to get Jinglu, and I also want Aventurine, so I was like, I gotta save. I did like a ten pool, like a, 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 a copium ten pool on her banner, and I was like, oh god, I have to hold off. Oh shit, what the fuck's going on?
この後の記憶は空白おっしゃそんなこのオルゴールがヨミさんの手に渡り彼女によってピノコニーに持ち込まれたのは事実 So earlier, um, Aaron pointed out something to me, or witness me pointed out something to me that, um, so Acheron makes, um, people lose their memories, I guess about her or whatever, and the only thing you could remember is the red text. It's something you're told, like, right at the beginning of the story that I, I did not remember. まるで消されたみたい。誰がそんなこと。And for extra context, if you haven't don't understand who she is and how big of a deal this is, she is from she is Black Swan from the Garden of Recollection. Um, she is working on the under the path of remembrance, which which is responsible for all memories. She can go into people's memories and look into it. So she generally knows the truth of all things because you can't lie about your memories is the whole idea of her. So the fact that she can't even look at these memories kind of shows how powerful Acheron is. What the fuck is going on? Who are you? Um, I guess, yeah. So, for example, um, I want to say it's just encounters with her, but I'm. I'm pretty sure, I think it's just encounters or things associating with her. But、um, for example, earlier,、um, we went to tell Welt our impression of her.、Um, we click on it, and it basically it tells you,、um, it basically it forces you to choose the last option, which says, weird, I don't remember any impression of her. And then we fi later find out that Acheron was in the area and she had a confrontation. She's, yeah. Which, yeah, that makes so. Yeah. She's basically a black hole. Yeah.、Um, which, black hole is literally what the Aeon of Nihility is.、Um, even my friend kind of pointed out that, like, being in a black hole kind of is like, you can't get out of it, kind of.、Um, Um, context Constance is one of the children of Ifrit who was supposed to who, who was killed, um, to our knowledge by Acheron and has every evidence of being killed by Acheron. Oh, yeah. And I don't see, I don't need a coming of age ceremony, and you, I know what you're looking for. Oh shit. And black hole is not good for someone who is based on valuable items? What do you mean by that, Sue?
あなたに忘れられない記憶が残りますように I wish you unforgettable memories <laughs> What? Memories, valuable items, precious things. Oh shit! Okay. You're right. You're right. Oh fuck! What's about to happen? Oh no. The watchful guardians, guardians of the marketing development department, in accordance with the interstellar peace charter, the independent Signodian sovereignty has hereby been established and shall take a legislative seat at the interstellar congress. Okay, okay, some, some little bit back from here. Um, so, Signonian um, is in reference to um, Aventurine. Um, Aventurine has been um, highly, like, there's little clues sprinkled about him that he's been revealed to be Signonian, and apparently they are, like, they have this really bad reputation of, or, like, this prejudice against them that they're liars and stuff like that, and they also seem to be treated like slaves. Um... So yeah, um, I had a theory, I was thinking about something because Topaz is another IPC member. Oh, Aventurine is an IPC member. Um, Topaz is another um, IPC member and she seems to have a strong connection to them by the fact that they saved her home planet. And she's trying to get other planets to forcibly like um, give their planet to them and make them save it um which my theory was that possibly the ipc hires people that owe them a debt and uh, makes them work uh work for them kind of or has them work for them and what makes it even worse is the fact that they um fight have to literally like try to show like or forcibly show positive results against each other so they can move up the ranks I, I think to get better benefits and shit like that, or more power and stuff like that. Yeah. But this is related to adventuring, specifically. The formation of the Signonian sovereignty is of great historical significance to the Signonia system. This move puts an end to the planet's long and bloody history, turning the sensational Kataka Afghan extension event into a distant memory. I'm constantly faced with this threat of impact from small scale celestial objects. Uh, Conria as a nation that uh, did not have a god, uh, where the, as the other nations have a god, they didn't have a god. So this is ooh, interesting. <laughs> 
意地があっても水はなくかんなりはあっても雨はなく血はあっても涙はない Water lightning. Oh shit. But not rain, blood, but not tears. You beat us with your falling star, you lash us with wind and storm, you chew us up with the cracked earth. この声が聞こえたならどうか目を開けてこの子を見てくださいあなたがこの子の父親を連れ去った時この子はまだ用水の中で眠っていました。そして今、私も夫のいる場所へ向かっている。私は自分が安らかに行くことなど望んでいません。ただ、産気で眠る我が子が。母の子供を雨降る大地の根を夢見ることができるか教えてくださいそうでないならなぜこの子は生まれたばかりで死を迎えようとしているのでしょうか Oh no. Bro. The voice acting is insane, though. Holy shit. Interesting way to end that. Schemes, secrets. Oh shit. Oh fuck. I don't even think I clicked that. That's such a pretty name.
Jumbra. Set ratio. Eventurine! <laughs> Our boy, the man himself. ああ、まあ、そうだろうね。ファミリーが気づいた夢の中で主が訪れるなんて誰も想像してないだろうし。ましてや被害者が調和セレモニーの広いんだなんて。It's funny how the first half of the stream or I was talking my ass off, but I'm just like in all right now. Like I don't know what to think at this moment. 正直僕は信じてなかったんだ。Soup had a theory that, um, or some other streamer, I don't know. She either, I think she either sent me a link or something to a streamer who had a theory that, um, it made a lot of sense, um, with all the symbolism that Stardust decides to do. Um, by the way, people seem to be dying in the dreamscape. Um, but... It's in a dreamscape, so they're, like, wondering what the fuck. Do they actually die in real life? There's no way, right? Like, you're not supposed to die in your dreamscape and then die in real life. Um, so, the theory that this theory that was um, given was that the death, you have to die by um, this creature who's a boss, called something onto death, and it will take you into a deeper part of the um, dreamscape that is not otherwise accessible, was kind of the theory. Um, yeah. <laughs>君も記憶域ミームについて聞いたことがあるだろう。君の香りに多くけとのコネクションを作りに行ったとき、彼らも頭を抱えていた。They must have heard about the memories on me. So yeah, something on to death is what I just mentioned. 死者はロビンの他にもう一人いる。密航者という that's a big word that I don't know. Malfia, Malfia songs? We're about to learn some vocabulary right now. Alright, everybody ready for a vocab lesson with me? Malfia songs is an act that is illegal and causes physical or monetary harm to someone else. That's the word of the day today. Mafia sauce? I think that's how you pronounce it. That, I'm hoping that's how you pronounce it. We're going with it. Um, the So, the bad deed that they did that will harm someone else. 
that harmed someone else, I guess. Which is, I guess, hiding people's deaths and shit. Also, Robin, to, to know the significance of them hiding Robin's death, she is a uh, sister, a younger sister in a huge big family of the Pentagoni. Malfisance. Malfisance? <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys, y'all missed me trying to figure out how to pronounce Acheron. I fucking, I, Aaron and Super trying to help me pronounce Acheron. <laughs> um, and I had a whole, <laughs> I made myself laugh from it. But thank you for trying to help. I'm a disaster. <laughs> うーん。またとない Interesting. Also, Vitroid seems to be the most open with ratio, but I guess that might be because of their um their business relationship at the moment. Almost on like ant, but with S. Ants. So, <laughs> yes, business relationship. Malfis. Malfi Sands? Is that how it's supposed to Malfi Sands? Yay! I got it! Vocab! Yay! ロビンは彼女の言うところの口の聞けない人だろ。彼女は声を失った。普通の人は気づかないかもしれないけど、僕の耳は誤魔化せない。あれは気管が発してる声じゃなくて調和の共鳴だ。but rather by the resonance of harmony. Awesome. Some extra context to this. So the end of the first part, um, Sparkle person I mentioned earlier, um, she's also masterful and she can disguise herself as other people, which doesn't help in the grand scheme of this plot and the fact that she can... Um... Not... Canonically? But you know what? We all wish it. We all see it. We all wish it, you know? It's it's a, and the, and Hoyo does not help. <laughs> Hoyo does not help. Um, but we we all there is yeah. I wish it. We all wish it. Let's be honest. Um, <laughs> um, what was I trying to say? Words are hard. Um, and thoughts are even harder at the moment. Oh, at the end of the first part, there is a confrontation with um, Sunday, the older brother of Robin, huge figurehead of the Pentacone. Um But Robin is being impersonated by Sparkle, and he figures that out. Um, but he, before that, before that 
revelation is made um he is nagging at her about her voice and saying that she needs to um she needs to i don't remember the exact words but it's like you need to fix your voice you need this is important for you to perform at the show it's important for the rest of the family and stuff like that essentially which is kind of cool about it coming from a brother who's supposed to care about his sister but he seems more worried about the reputation of the family over his sister's voice having a problem yeah me and so mc and eventrain had arrived to see her die ファミリーも一応は君のアリバイを信じている。だが今後おそらく君はハウンドの監視のもとで過ごすことになるだろう。現状は楽観できないね、教授。まあ、冷や汗が出てきた。この局面まだひっくり返せる可能性はあると思う
But get get the good sleep, you guys. Get the good rest. Um, I'll be continuing this tomorrow at the same time from, oh, what is it, nine to twelve? Yeah, and possibly Sunday, if needed, because I I took a long time talking on certain slides, as Aaron knows. So, who knows how long this will take? Um, but yeah, let's see. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed uh, the stream. Oh, yeah, I forgot to give you guys a little bit of a the likes of ordinary guests would never grace these mounds in their lifetime. Look around while you still have a moment of freedom. ねえ、教授。随分な言い草だけど、君は一体どちらの味方なのかな？僕が君を裏切らないと誰が保証できる？ <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> I love that expression that Ratio has. He's turning kind of pouty. <laughs> その支配欲に満ちた多くけの当主にあったら、僕が彼の口から答えを引き出してみせるから。ついてこい。彼の応接室に案内する。余計なことは言うな。ファミリーの相手は僕に。ウェイ、ウィシ、ウィシュチーズ
um, incredibly chill, chaotic, amazing. I, I love her streams. Um, for anybody else, um, I do have a YouTube channel if you want to check out my VODs. Um, I'm slowly transforming over to another channel, but there, a lot of them are still there on my main channel, which is just Deviathan, no underscore. Um, but everybody, have a good end to your night or a good start to your day, guys. Um, and let's send Reap the good vibes as well.